here are my Ford Fiesta Mark 8 settings. Alignment. Brakes. Differential. Gearing. Damping. And springs. All right, so with damping, I'm not exactly sure what the optimum setting for this is. So I left it at uh, default, it's right in the middle. That is the activation speed, obviously. And I have no idea how fast the bumps are. And it seems to work fine at, at the default setting, so I'm gonna leave them. All right, I'm gonna do some driving. So this is a time trial, so I'm starting here. At Canada. This is one of my favorite tracks now. Oopsie. So I have the, uh, the brake bias pretty far forward because I like stability on the brakes. I don't like it uh, snapping around and spinning around in a crucial braking moment, especially when I over brake. So it's set up to understeer on the brakes at, at uh, maximum braking lock anyway. And so to get it turned around on the brakes, you want to give it throttle while you're coming off the brakes. And then also pulse, pulse the brake and the throttle to get it turning mid-corner. But other than that, the car is nice and stable. Slides really nice. It doesn't snap oversteer on throttle lifts. Has a little bit of understeer, but it's manageable. Nothing a little uh, handbrake could fix. I don't use the handbrake on, on my wheel because it's mapped to my wheel, so I try not to use it. If I had a, a lever handbrake or, or at least a, an off-wheel button mapped to the handbrake, I'd you'd be using a handbrake to get it sliding more, but uh, I don't. So these are the settings. This is how it drives. Slides real nice. That's it. See you in the next one.